Okay, today I'm going to show you something interesting that I found on my Twitter page. Uh, a while ago, I had shared details of an experiment I performed where I connected a, a wire to the gutter system of the house and a wire to the ground and wound a little coil and connected an LED 2.2 volt, 20 milliamp LED um, with, with a color, um, with clear glass. Ooh, I can't talk. Oh. Um, and it lit the LED, um, but somebody in Australia repeated this experiment. Now let me show y'all. Anyway, now I will share the um, screen recording I took. This person repeated my um, experiment as per my instructions on Twitter and here. Oh, and for your information, the first time he tried to repeat the experiment, it didn't work because he didn't file his points properly and stuff. But I'll share, I'll show that part of that too. Um, the first clip's about three minutes. The second clip where it's working is about one minute. Yeah, we've got an alligator clip connecting to the end of the copper, going to the top of this solenoid, which has roughly a hundred turns, 0.5 millimeter um, wire. Down below, I touched a screw just for the wire to hold on to, and then an easy point for the alligator clip to access. Then goes around, connects to the top of the secondary drilled a little hole for the axis, so then go around, wrap around about 16 times, comes out there, I then connect an alligator clip to there, connect it to the anode of the LED on the ground side, connecting to the earth. So in this whole setup, the potential difference is between the earth and the gutter system as per what Dr. Parkenstein is saying. And in this setup, you can see no light is being produced. So now I will go up here. So I feel a bad connection has been made. Let's see how I'm connecting it. Pretty shit connection, but see what it's like. So I went to my cousin's house just to try at a different location. I connected to the neighbor's gutter. Long cable run. I extend it all the way. It's probably, you know, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, about thirteen meters. So you can see it all the way. Yeah. We've got an alligator clip connecting to the end of the copper. Go into the top of this solenoid, which has roughly a hundred turns, point five millimeter um, wire. Down below I touched a screw just for the wire to hold on to and then an easy point for the alligator clip to access. Then goes around, connects to the top of the secondary, drilled a little hole for the access, so then go around, wrap around about 16 times, comes out there, I then connect an alligator clip to there connect it to the anode of the LED on the ground side connecting to the earth so in this whole setup the potential difference is between the earth and the gutter system as per what at a different location I connected to the
can see the light. That's phenomenal. as per what Dr. Parkenstein is saying. The ideal pre and post-workout nutrition. Formula